Turkish Prime Minister Ahmet Davutoglu hailed Sunday's election as another victory for the ruling AKP. But with just under 41% of the vote, down from over 49% in 2011, the result was a major blow. Former party leader and current president Recep Tayyip Erdogan said the results don't give a mandate to any single party and must be realistically assessed. The secular CHP won 25% of the vote, the nationalist MHP 16.5% and the pro-Kurdish HDP 13%. Sunday marked an end to the AKP's 13-year-long single-party rule. The party now faces the challenge of forming a government. Nationalist leader Devlet Bajeli ruled out joining a coalition and laid out the alternatives. The first possibility should be a coalition between the AKP and HDP. The second model is a coalition between the AKP, CHP and HDP. If these two options fail, early elections must be held. Sunday's biggest winner was the HDP. With 13% of the vote, it's the first time a pro-Kurdish party has exceeded the 10% threshold and will enter parliament.